钱了。Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be on this fly hair that I have in my head right now. This is a U part wig from Her Giving Hair. It was a custom wig. I got mine in the curly texture. I can't remember how long it is, but I'll definitely leave it in the description bar. Every time I see somebody with the U part wig, they're always wearing it like just straight down or something. So I'm gonna show you guys a few easy styles you can do with your U-part wig if you don't wanna just wear your hair down. Like, it's kind of boring, right? I didn't show you guys how I put it on and all that stuff, but if you wanna see it, let me know in the comments and I'll do another video on how I actually apply it and like what my actual hair looks like under this wig. So yeah, if you guys are interested in that, just keep on watching. So the first style is super simple. It's just gonna be a half up, half down style. Make sure your wig is clipped in. It does come with five clips and adjustable straps. It also comes with an elastic band and additional clips if you wanted to sew it in yourself. And I'm obviously just super lazy, so I didn't. So make sure it's clipped in, and then I'm just using a clip to put up the top half, and this is the first style. Now the second style, I'm just sectioning off the front of my hair and I'm gonna do a flat twist. And I'm gonna do that on both sides. And then I'm just gonna secure it in the back with the clip. And I'm just brushing the part of my hair that's out just to help it blend a little bit better with the wig and I'm done Now the third style, I'm using a snappy to just put all of the hair in a ponytail. If you see bits of the wig is peeking through your hair, just adjust your hair and cover it up. It's super easy. And I'm using a snappy just because it was easier for me to put all of this hair in a ponytail. Now for this next style, which is the one that I was the most lazy with just because I was kind of in a rush, I'm putting my hair in two braids towards the back, so I'm just gonna do a braid on both sides. Once I'm done with that, I'm just gonna put a squinchy over it once, take half of the hair and wrap it around, just like I did on my top knot video, which I'll leave a card for up above if you haven't checked that out. And as you can see, the wig started lifting up and this is what I meant when I said I was just being lazy. I didn't make sure it was on properly or none of that good stuff, but it's okay. It's okay, I'll show you guys how to fix that. And now with the rest of the hair, I'm just spreading it apart and using a squinchie to hold it down. And now I'm just gonna twist the rest of the hair around and make it into a bun. Really, you don't have to do all of these steps. You can just do a bun however is easier for you. And now the part where the wig was lifting up, I'm just gonna use bobby pins and clip it down. And there you have it, a nice big full updo. Now 
Now this next style is one that we've seen 101 times, but I just can't get over how cute it is. I'm just gonna do a top knot, and I think that it looks so much better with this wig because the wig has so much volume. Again, this is the curly wig, and all I did was just brushed out the curls with my Demon brush, and it gave me this blowout look, so I love it so much, especially with the top knot bun. And for this last look, I'm just taking the front of my hair and I'm gonna do a flat twist in the front and this is just gonna be like a twisted headband look. And as you can see, the wig is showing again. But again, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that. So I'm gonna go ahead and secure the twist in the back with some bobby pins. And then I'm gonna take bobby pins again and just clip the hair over where the wig is showing. Super simple. And that's it guys, this was the last look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you share it. I do have some updates on my giveaway and it does involve you know, more people having access to my channel. So yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video.